Let's see where we want to go with this. This one pissed everyone off on an episode before. I talked about hygiene. Okay. Do you think that if a girl has like hairy armpits or doesn't shave, that that's considered bad hygiene? I think if you're making a choice, then it's not bad hygiene. Would you date a girl that had armpit hair? If she had armpit hair? Like if she lifted up her arm and it looked like a man. I'm not talking about like a teeny bit of stubble. This okay? is the clip that's going to be on TikTok. I can I- already <laughs> tell. I can no, already tell it's just how Lauren rolls. This before, is the Tucker Carlson clip. This is not my this Tucker is, Carlson this clip. Is, this is the one that gets because angry in the, in the comments. I'm just saying that I personally... Like hair to me, I have had laser hair removal all over my body. I'm like a fucking dolphin. Like, I got you. I like to. Swim I get my back smooth. waxed. See, like yeah. I personally. I know. I on a girl. I go mullet party in the front, bald in the back. That's me. I go. I got a, a men's in the shape of a phoenix rising from the ashes. Yeah. And then the back is totally clean. Not right now. I'm a little embarrassed, but I, you know, to me. You know, there's, there, you know, it's two things. Not generally, not my type. If you're going to have underarm hair as a woman, that's, but not my, not my type, not my problem. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like I, I kind of live my life that way. Do you? Do you boo? Yeah. You know, like it's not. Look good, feel good. Look good, feel good, be good. And I think if that's <laughs> what makes you feel good, then be good. You know, like I don't know the, you know, this feels like a political answer, but it's really not. This is truly how I feel. Mm-hmm. Like I, I. Because also, if someone had underarm hair, I would also go like, oh, like, this person's off the radar. Like, they're doing <laughs> something different. You know, that's not like, again, that's not mainstream. Mainstream is dolphin. I, I what mean, you're but, doing. I mean. Yeah. As a, as in the, listen, I will tell you this. There was a point where a woman had pubic hair. Uh-huh. And we hooked up, and I was so turned on. Because she was... Now like full the, bush? Bush, loved it. Love full bush. Um, because now the default is dolphin. You're doing what most women do, mm-hmm. which is fine. And yeah. that makes you feel good, be good, you know, do good. When I see full bush, I'm like, ooh, this person made a decision. It, that's, con- that's hot to me. So, like, there's an element of, like, I do me. I, you know... Full bush means, you know, and this is like the problem with men. Like this is my male intuition, which is not, which is a little icky sometimes. Yeah. Because I see full bush. I'm like, they have made, they have opted for something that makes them feel good, Uh which means they're thinking about it, which means they're thinking about how it looks down there in a way that, you know, sleek dolphin really isn't thinking. It's just, this is what I do. So to me, it's kind of hot. I'm just (laughs) saying I'm Italian. Yes. And I have so much hair on my body. It is unreal. Again, it's the same thing as getting a spray tan to me. Like you, you're doing that to feel good in your own body, which is the hardest thing in the world. If like, I didn't have a lot of hair, maybe I'd want more of it. Because we right. always want. What we don't have. I get you. I don't know. The bush to me, hot. So maybe, you know, if I was surprised by the underarm hair, but usually there's like a certain type of person that yeah. does the underarm hair. So like. And that's my pre, you know, pre-existing, you know, biases. Um, you know, I just realized what it is. I think it's that I probably wouldn't have a pretty bush. A pretty bush. Like I would grow like the Amazon. Well, wouldn't you fashion it? Like there's, a, you know, just like trim it. Yeah, there's a, people don't say I'm growing a bush and then go whatever happens. You know? <laughs> like I don't think that's how it goes with bush people. <laughs> I don't know. I guess in my head, that's how I think it goes. Because no, you're like, mine is braided on each side. There's a little braid <laughs> with uh, a scrunchie on both of the sides. That's the way I do mine. Frosted tips. Frosted tips. I okay. put a little, a little lightning bolt on, on, in the middle as the part. You know those parts that go zigzag? That's what mine is. Mine zigzag parts at the top, <gasps> braided, frosted tips, <laughs> and then scrunchies on both. There's a lot going on down here. <laughs> 37 oh and single on Netflix God. right now. You can go oh. watch it streaming for all your viewing Shit. pleasures. There's oh. a whole bit about bush braiding. Oh, I actually man. give a tutorial. 
this was that was <laughs> that was much more for me than anybody Listen, else. Listen, the I audience, really I don't know. Needed to hash that out with. Sorry, someone. ladies, for making everyone too wet. Look, that was that was <laughs> truly that was invigorating. I love that. First date, baby. Are you really drinking a glass of milk with dinner? First date, I can't wait. You told your mom about me. 